Hi foodies, what about some soursop ice cream? Yep, it's in season. Let's get started. So here is a soursop. This is what it looked like. I had it in the refrigerator so it turned a little dark. So here I have a half of a soursop. And today we're going to be making some lovely soursop ice cream. And this is all you need. Heavy cream, some good almond essence or extract. We're using some Angostura bitters from the house of Angostura from that beautiful island of Trinidad and Tobago. Here is my condensed milk and a pinch of salt. And of course, we're going to be using a few drops of lime juice. So let's get started. You need your magic bullet. So I have it right here. And your cake mixer. And your whipped cream. That's for your whipped cream. So what you're going to be doing, I ate half of this off. I love it so much, I don't trust myself. So you're just going to peel it off. Just take all the skin off. And we're going to save the pulp just like so. So pull them off. Get the seed out of it so cloudy and so sweet oh my goodness and so silky this is all you're going to be doing empty it into your magic bullet with a little bit of water and we're going to puree that so to add some milk or you could add the water i think the milk will make it more creamy so now in goes a few drops of lime lime juice and that looks marvelous so now let me put the apparatus on into this and we're just going to zap this until it becomes a lovely puree here in my bowl, I want to add my whipped cream. And we're going to beat this up and let it get really creamy. So now let's just mix everything in. Ooh, I missed a seed. Let me take that seed out. Just a pinch of salt to balance off everything in there. And Angostura, a little dash of that. In goes some vanilla extract that's about enough and now let's add in our sweetness so this is my condensed milk let me pour all of them in there that looks marvelous and now i just want to add a little hint of cardamom powder and let's get that in now and just whip this up and combine so there you go you see how rich and thick and i tasted it and this is just perfect so now Let's fill them in to put them to freeze. So here I have my little one size, <laughs> one serving size. So we don't want to fill it up too much because you know, when it hits the freezer, it's going to swell up and get a little bigger. So this looks fine. Let's point it this one now. And I'm going to put them into the refrigerator for overnight. There you go. That is perfect. I have these little covers that they come with. We're just going to lock it in just like so. If you have the paleta or the palettes, you could use that also. This is a little too much, so let me take some out. Yeah, that is just about enough because it's going to get freeze and it's going to come up to the top and you don't want your ice cream exploding over. So I took some out and give them a good little seal. If you wish to put a piece of clear wrap over it, you could go ahead and put them now into the freezer, not the fridge. We're going to freeze this because this is ice cream. So lovely ice cream here from Jenny's Walk. Fresh sour sub ice cream here. I got that sour sub from Puerto Rico and we make that lovely. So let's put this up now to freeze and just wait for overnight to give it a good try. Okay, my dear foodies, I will long await. I had this overnight, so it is like eight hours old. So let's open up that and look at that lovely, creamy goodness day of that sour sub ice cream in this cute little disposable you could buy and you could put them in or you could make them palette or you could put them in a very big one. So it's that time now. So just leave it out for like five minutes before you start which you see I did not do that. So by leaving it out for like five minutes before you start digging into it, it will be a lot more creamy and easier. So let me try this now. Oh, wow. Mmm. Foodies, this is so rich and thick. It's like eating the fresh fruit as I was doing. And I have the pulp that is in there. I didn't strain it off. So you have that pieces of pulp in there. Oh, wow. This is my dessert today. Mmm. Delightful. Mmm. -mm. 
delightful simple and easy put together sour sap ice cream here from jenny's walk always bring in great flavors to the table sour sap in season give it a try simple and easy and it would be a lovely snack here for your kids you could take it to the park just secure it well so my dear foodies thank you for joining me from my kitchen to your kitchen happy cooking